Welcome, Welcome back to, to the Flonkerton. basement. Let's play the friendliest place on YouTube. <laughs> hey, Flonkerton, how you doing? Flonkerton the ninja. <laughs> That's not a very good ninja name. Flonkerton is gonna uh, keep uh, keep on doing what he's doing, which um, is um, we're yeah we're going around and fighting stuff. So so far it's it's playing a lot more like Shovel Knight than it is playing like a Metroidvania. Yes, although it's more of a platformer, but we might find out that everything's connected. In yeah, which these case, are starting to branch. I feel I mean, branchy anyway. Well, that was a s tiny little branch with a secret in it. Teeny tiny. But I, I kind of wonder where you know if everything ends up being connected and there are routes that go that connect everything together, then it's a Metroidvania. You know, right? It's weird. Metroidvania is just basically another word for maze. That's a video game. Uh, pretty much, yeah. And where there's a lot of backtracking, but you can open new stuff f because of new abilities. Whoa, Holy cow! Dude, you nailed that! You can really scoot Ooh, up Flonkerton. those things. Flonkerton's a scooter. That wasn't, like, a whole lot of... Dude, yeah, we could totally just attack these. You can also cloud jump out of them. I don't know if you want to try that, but... I probably do. Nice. Oh. I have a feeling that's going to be a thing later. I don't think you need to attack that guy. It doesn't give you anything. Yeah, I wasn't totally planning on it. The but only thing I he gave up. you was ouchies. Oh, sweet. Oh, this feels like pre boss room. Uh, no, no. Let's go and spend your coin. Let's see what we got. Well, the thing that you can buy is the. Uh, oh, you get the chest. What's that? What's with this big mysterious chest? It appeared when you smashed your first power seal. Oh, okay. Well, let's open Good it up. Know. Up. You still need to smash 44 power seals to open that. Oh, well, we're getting close. <laughs> right, Aren't we? Need, need anything? anything? What do you want to <laughs> chat about, level boss? Looks like you're almost to the end of this area. Did I forget to mention there's a giant leaf monster guarding the exit? Oh, no! I hope he leafs me alone. You did. Haha, <laughs> ha, that look on your face, don't worry, my dear adventure. Leaf monsters only come out during a full moon. Uh, it happens to be a full moon. Oh, it is a full moon right now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's, uh, I didn't mean to. Well, good luck. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't tell us anything about it. All right, let's see what our upgrade options are. We have not enough for the serendipitous bodies. If it's red, you can't get it. If it's yellow, you can. It's green, we uh, enemies have Enemies will sometimes drop a globe that restores one hit point. I know, but like, if it's close, we might want to not buy something at a shop so we can get it next oh, shop. Oh, true. Enemies will sometimes drop... Okay, uh, so chi or HP drops, or the 50%, or press B while being knocked back to do an air recovery jump. B? That is the jump button. I'm I think that it. that's right. That's like that's your instinct is when you get hit to jump out of it so you yeah. don't fall down a hole, you know? Mm, yeah. Please, Please don't, don't touch, touch the, cabinet. the cabinet. I already I, told you the cabinet is off limits. Did we Believe me, you're not ready for what's in there. Okay. Yeah, he's just going to keep going through that rigmarole. But we never you never did get a repeat. I didn't. We should All do right. it. We should do it at some point. Basement dollars, let us All know right. if you want to see us do that whole thing and see if we can ever get a repeat. Leaf monster, let's see what we've got. I see a mysterious golden pile of leaves. I also see um a platform that I could maybe double jump to. Whoa. Whoa. Ooh, he doesn't look very happy. Wow. Whoa. Oh, I can duck underneath that. <laughs> That's not too bad. Whoa! Whoa! He's shooting okay. leaves. Oh, he's creepy. When yeah, he we're have learning. Leaves on him. Come down here, you. Ah, forgot to duck. Fine. Can you d jump up? Uh, well, I can't grab that part of that wall. You can't grab the lower part of the wall. No, because it's. Oh, I guess I could a little. I mean, this seems to be working. Yeah, you got, you got, you figured out his patron. Just takes well, a little time. Uh, see, I was trying to see if I could do this. Eh, oh, not enough. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's worth it. No, I'm gonna go with what works. Dude, his face is very crazy looking. Oh, you got him! Got him! Dude, nice! He is creepy. That music was pretty cool. He was creepy. Now he's dead. Now he's just a pile of leaves. Sabotage Studios. Uh, now's a good time to mention that um, I Kickstarter backed the sequel to this game. The prequel oh. to this game. 
Um, it's a different style game. It's in the style of uh, Secret of Mana or um, Chrono Trigger. Mm-hmm. So it's an action-oriented kind of RPG <gasps> game. And it's like meant to, to have that same vibe. And it's a prequel to this story. But here's the cool thing. I Kickstarter backed it at the level where the basement is going to be in the credits. Really? Yeah. Nice. What what and would you like to chat about? Forlorn Temple, huh? That's a sad one. How so? Haven't paid much attention during history lessons, have you? No. Adventurer types rarely do, I get it. <laughs> so the short of it is, that four-headed monster who would have killed you earlier if that cooler than you hero hadn't intervened, that's the Demon King. <laughs> cooler than you hero. It's like, um... X in Mega Man X. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I was thinking Dude, the same I be There's him. Zero, yeah. <laughs> he brought his armies to the human realm many centuries ago and destroyed their stronghold, forcing them to retreat into hiding. <laughs> and he's been sitting on their throne ever since. Ooh. You mean this all that's left is human legacy? Wow, good reading. <laughs> For what it's worth, I'm sorry. No way. I will go and take down that demon king right now. You wouldn't be the first to try. Would I be the first to die? I can't just stand by while some evil monster gloats over my people's misery. You are still too weak to consider taking on even his second in command. <laughs> Let alone his second form. <laughs> I'm going. I bet you can't even make it to the entrance without falling into the pit. I'll bet you can't even have a candy shell oh, on your head. I will. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Do you have any stories to share? Of course, here's one for you. There once is a princess looking for a suitable husband. She sent an invitation to all neighboring princes, stating that the main trait that she was looking for was sensitivity. Also, he has to be able to read. <laughs> <laughs> Contenders came and went, attempting to pass her test. You will be my guest tonight, the princess would explain. All I need you to do is sleep in that pile of mattresses. <laughs> the prince and the pea. Yeah, I think it is. The next morning, she would ask them how their night was. <laughs> I had the best sleep of my life, each would reply, confident they had proved they didn't fear the dark or that they could be easily or that they could be easy guests. They were all promptly dismissed. One day, an especially sensitive prince reported he couldn't sleep at all. Oh, I just was... Uh... My feelings were hurt. My back. Ouch. I don't know what was up with that pile of mattresses, he went on. It looked comfortable enough, but when I laid on it, it was like I had a fork stuck in my kidney. <laughs> they got married the next day. Oh, everyone knows that story. There was a pee underneath the pile, so someone who's extremely sensitive wouldn't be able to sleep. Yes, but have you ever heard of what happened after? <laughs> uh, happily ever? <laughs> For the first few weeks, everything was amazing. The prince would always complain. <laughs> Just the guy she asked for. When the soup wasn't too hot, it was the cutlery that was too cold. <laughs> when the music wasn't too loud, the paintings were uninspired. And when the clothes weren't itchy, the poems were predictable. <laughs> Until one day, just like that, it dawned on, all, on the princess that she was in a toxic relationship. <laughs> Not only was her husband a drag, she had voluntarily picked him up for that exact reason. <laughs> hmm, ladies, you paying attention? It dawned on her just like that how this whole love story was nothing more than two people whose dysfunctions matched like puzzle pieces. Ooh, enablers. <laughs> Incredibly humbled by real standards, she realized that she was the only constant in all her problems, delved into personal growth, then got a divorce. Wow. <laughs> she lived happily ever after. <laughs> The end. <laughs> uh, maybe she could have told him yeah, maybe about they could her have both, feelings and he could have worked, worked on, on himself. It. Yeah, maybe they both could have worked on it. Got into marriage counseling. Yeah, no, the divorce is not a solution to an unhappy marriage. Mo most of the time. Yeah. I would but say. That, and she, I have a lot of experience having have been a, married once. She did have, have a pretty weird criteria for a husband, though. It wasn't like... Oh, he. We have to have the same moral standards, or we have to. Uh, I'm a little you know, concerned we to, about. We have to be, you know, on the same belief structures, or have you know similar worldviews, mm. or uh, want the same amount of kids, or have you know similar financial. Cool. Do you see what happened? Yeah, I was... couldn't jump across. I know. He said, "I bet you can't even get there without falling into the big pit." Oh, oh look at this little guy. Well, dude, if you go back, instead of zooming in on everything... Oh, you little guy! Dude, the pixels are the same size. Oh, you little guy! Okay, he's huge. Up there. That's good. <laughs> okay. 
You scared me. I thought you were an undead. What kind of creature are you? You've never seen a phobican? <laughs> uh, phobican? We're a tribe of builders, technically very hardworking, but very every one of us is cursed by a unique fear, which we are named ah, after. Phob, I got it. Phobican? I haven't even phobed once. How can I, mean, I phobican? <laughs> What's your name? Necro. Oh, he's afraid of dead, dead things. things. Necro, so you fear the dead and somehow ended up in a catacombs? Ironic, isn't it? Well, I'm glad you still have a smile I on your face. I fell while trying to repair the temple ruins above, and I was instantly paralyzed by all this morbidity. Anyway, thanks for snapping me out of it. I really should get back to work. That's true. A phobkin. Uh, okay, I'm guessing we can swipe this thing. Watch out, pal. Ooh, a pink bat. Was that a just a sound effect noise or a watch out? Because no, right I... then I was watching out. <laughs> Felt oh! Great. Ah. 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 Um. You can jump on top of it and get across? Maybe. I feel like you have to grab the side of it. I, you probably have options. Uh. Oh. Like, the side of it looks so much more solid, but really you can grab any side of it. That's kind of weird. Ugh. Nice. Thank you. Ah! Yeah! Why did I not see him coming? My health is very low. It is really low. Ah! You better watch out, you bad boys. Darkwing Duck! Oh, see if we had the 50% thing. We haven't even gotten 400 things yet. Oh, perfect timing. It was my turn to buy a round. Does that mean he's not going to charge us? Oh, nah. no. He needs to buy a round, so all this extra money is going to help him out. Ooh. Glad they're reinforcing the double jump there. Okay. The, the skeleton is short. He's kind of cute because of how short he is. Yeah, he's got like. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, and he takes these fat little, fast little funny steps. Ah! Yeah! <sighs> well done, Peter. Well, not really. Was that sarcasm? Yeah, it was because you're too afraid to use uh, your shuriken that you, like, won't use it. Well, I might should. run out. You're going to run out. They come back if you, I mean, they, you can't get any more there. Than, good job. You can't get any more than three, so you might as well use up at least one, so that way when they recharge, then you, that's a good point. There's that's at least like something a, that appeals to my hoardingness. Exactly. How did he reappear? He, uh, if they go, if you go off the screen, they come back. I didn't, he didn't even go all the way off the screen, though. Remember, you can hit their projectiles. Yeah, instead I, of right I tried to. It with was your an accident. sword rather than your face. It was an accident, Ted. Oh, oh, yes. dude, skills. Yes. Secrets. Whoa, that's cool. I don't know what that is. Hit it a bunch of times. Uh, I think it's probably nothing. Yeah, just go away. Go yeah. away from it. I'm sure oh, it's not oh, worth it. Oh, yeah, it's a yeah, whole bunch of coins. Uh, Keep going. Huh? Yeah. He. Huh? Uh oh. Just keep going. Am I gonna get too greedy? I don't know. Is a monster gonna come out? Whoa. I don't think so. I think that was just awesome is what happened. Dude, that was awesome. We'll keep him keep keep our eyes out for giant glowy It made me a little nervous, to um, be honest. Stalagmites. Ooh. So be prepared for me to be very critical of your playstyle in this game. <laughs> I've been preparing for that for six and a half years. Okay, cool. <laughs> Peter! Yes. I realized something today. Uh, my son Micah just turned 12. Whee! When we met, Lisa was 10 months, or not 10 months, 8 months pregnant with Micah. <laughs> we have been friends for over 12 years. Oh my dude. gosh. Pregnant with Micah? Yeah. Because remember the first time you played bass, she was so pregnant that she had to like, hold it sideways? Yeah, I do remember and that. She, that like, was asked, Micah? That was Micah in there. Oh, I gotta use this guy. Because, dude, the, the, the church, we were in the gymnasium version of the church. That's right. That was before the room turn. Yeah. Oh, man. That was a long time. Uh, oh. Whoa. Uh. Did he just laugh like, ah, ah, ah. Oh, I can't leave. Okay, next time in the basement, Ted's going to fight this guy. What? No. Oh, wait, he's not here. Until next time, Basin Dwellers, uh, be sure to check out some of our other stuff. If you're like, oh my gosh, I can't wait 
Till the next basement video, we've got a uh, great selection of basement stuff up in the corner for you to check out. And uh, until next time, basement dwellers, we think that you are more purple and dying than <laughs> Prince, or the artist formerly known as Prince. Oh no, <laughs> in, in the, the basement. basement.